What's going on guys, thanks for checking out another Eastern Current video up here today with Steve and Drew of Griffin's Guide Service. We're going to try to catch some massive uh, stripers. My biggest is 33, maybe 34. Uh, I think we can maybe beat that. I've got a feeling it's going to be beaten, that's all I'm going to say. Uh, but what a cool area. We were worried about some weather this morning and it's really way nicer than they were calling for. So we're going to get after it, see if we can catch the big fish. But man, thanks for having us up. Thanks probably, thanks for yeah, coming. for sure. Y'all stay tuned. God, those birds are so freaking sick. Those old squall, those birds are they're beautiful birds. Can you not shoot them? No, you can shoot them. They're a type of sea duck. Did you shoot some of them when you went up to uh I've shot them here in the Chesapeake and I've shot them up in Cape Cod. There's oh. Got one. Yes, sir. That feels like a good fish too. Shot all I can see is yeah, that's a good fish. God, he ate the freaking out of it. Back. Don't mess this up, Judge. I'm gonna try not to. I'll be honest, it feels it feels like the biggest striper I've ever hooked. It's definitely yeah. the biggest striper. Should I boat flip him when I get him close? I knew we should have bought some of those mud minnows last night. <laughs> I don't think strikers eat mud minnows. Nope, they do. Oh, no. Oh. Just glued on the bottom, isn't it? Yep. This is sick. <laughs> My favorite duck is right beside me too. You hear them? Yeah. They're just so pretty, man. This old squall. Come on. Oh yeah, that's my biggest striper. Did it already have to go? Yep. <laughs> How much did you bet? <laughs> oh, this thing is awesome. God, it just like popped over its like mouth a little bit. It felt like I lost it for a split second. Oh, this is awesome. You think you can get over the gunnel and come up the step? Yep. Get on that side of you. I do. Come on, girl. I'm just so nervous. I've just this size fish on this tackle to not. I'll take that. Dude. Good fish. Thank you. That is incredible. God. She ate it so hard. Oh, it's a thump. It's a thump. Oh, man. That was sick. All right. For the release, just kind of hold her head in the water. Watch out for the treble hooks. <laughs> yeah.
Well, that's my biggest fish. What was it, 41? Yep. Good one. That's incredible. That was awesome. Nice Thank you. Work. Buddy. Nice work. We're here with the fishing pose. I yeah. do want to see something wrecked one on that right there. There's fishing poles and then there's spinning rods. And there we're gonna catch a big striper. And then we're gonna Marty, feed them to the turtles. There it is. I felt him the whole time. <laughs> I've got a buddy who uh, fishes with me quite often. You got that one running? Yep. Okay. And, uh, he said, he always said, That's a nice fish, Steve. Uh, that's a nice, that's a nice fish. Yeah, you get that later? Yeah. Like sea life. Yeah, he is. God, chunky. Just... He is so chunky. Fatty. Can we get a pick? Yeah, and then when you're going down, just make sure you keep it like I just it's more of a wrist and you know, when they get down and just stay with it on the way down. Okay. Oh, I just got freaking tabernacled, Jod. Tabernacled, baby. Alright, we found them. <laughs> Also good. I hate guys like you, Drew. I do too. <laughs> there, it there it is, Mike. Of course, I don't have the GoPro on you. <laughs> that was the perfect hook set for me. Yeah, I know. <laughs> that feels like a much better fish than the last one. Oh, yeah. Yeah, that's a better one. That's a fatty. Yes, sir. Uh, you got him? What a beauty, Heck brother. yeah. <laughs> nice work. <laughs> Hell yes. Oh. Thank you. Chandler, oh! <laughs> Chandler goes getting bent. <laughs> what a beauty. Good God. That is a fatty. He's just so fat. Oh, 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 oh! <laughs> hot potato, hot potato! He's gonna spike you. I know. There's no way that thing's not 30. No. It's <laughs> just... It's the fattest 26 <laughs> ever. <laughs> Bye, bud! Fly <laughs> down, that was like a perfect release. Oh, that was awesome. Thank you, sir. Thank you, brother. Thank you. It's oh, definitely yeah, the buddy. heaviest fish I've ever had. Or heaviest striker I've ever had. That was, that was a very fat fish. There's, There's some like fish. That. that was just like that round and just as round. You're running a fish and I'm holding the camera. <laughs> I don't think there's anything wrong with it. Yeah, I bet you like it. <laughs> I mean, somebody. Chandler's first striper. <laughs> Swing him around. You got to treble. Let him. The cameraman. I hate the treble hook land. Yeah. Hey Michael, personal best. Yes, sir. Seven TVs all day. It's all day. <laughs> oh, she's pretty. She's little. <laughs> we gotta get a bigger one. Price that's good. like a normal. That, that's a little bit bigger than a schoolie that we get. That's true. Definitely fat. Yeah, it's a nice fish. That last one was so big. It like had a, a I can't right, it had a right angle. Oh my it just got to get back to its tail. <laughs> is this a strapper? Is this your first one? This is the first. Heck yeah. We should probably let him go. <laughs> He's been out of the water for a few seconds. He should be fine though. I can do a right hand or two on a big top. 
Feel free to give it a shot if you want. This is a... Nice! We did it! I'll help you get him. <laughs> Heck yeah! On the jig! Working on it. That's my best one up. Personal best. Come here, come here, come here. Is everybody on the boat down personal best? Not y'all two. Yeah, that's true. You have to fix it. Sucky day since y'all didn't get personal you best. You nice fish, Chandler. I sure will. And then when am I stopping that? Um, when it hit, when, when it stops and hits the bottom, you just come tight. Okay. You're going to stop at the bottom or it's going to stop There he is. Oh, <laughs> oh, that's a good fish. <laughs> Trebles. Like I said, I've I've fished the flutter spoon since I was a kid, and it's all I'll ever throw. <laughs> First drop, you know, I'm not gonna put this thing down the rest of the day now. <laughs> That's, a <good> fish. <laughs> That's a really good fish. I don't know if I can use this thing with this like tribal freaking tattoo on it. Oh. Oh! <sighs> I, yeah, I hooked up, popped free, and then hooked up again. Yeah, that's. I mean, it's not a small fish, but. It's definitely a, isn't a monster. You're on. Oh. Doubles on the back, baby. Nice. Oh, yep. That's a quadruple. Oh. <laughs> That's sick. Good fish? Oh my gosh, they're just hammering it. Oh. If it ain't flutter, it ain't butter, baby. <laughs> Did I stutter? I fished a flutter. <laughs> oh, that's a fun bite too on that thing. And I love how you just get them all under the chin. <laughs> I was getting like five or six bites every time it was dropping though. Just boom, 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 boom. Oh, oh my God. <laughs> it's getting silly in here. <laughs> Your phone never texts me 10 4, it always texts me 10 flow. I, I type out 10 flow because I think it's sick. <laughs> <laughs> God, I feel like I'm about to get slack lined on the way down. You better get flogged or not. Oh, yep! Yeah. Oh. Uh oh. Is that a good one? <laughs> Is that a triple up around the boat? Yes, sir! I'm I'm Come on! Beauty. Chandler, so what do you think about striper fishing? Dude, it's so easy. <laughs> Why do people not do this all the time? Because not everybody lives here. <laughs> <laughs> That's a nice fish, brother. Yeah, 
mean, that's a that's a 20 inch fish. 22 something. They are so they are so thick right now. There you go. Oh my gosh! That spoon is so fun, dude. Holy smokes! Is it? Oh, I'd say we found them. I mean, just such a massive school of fish, man. It's crazy. Every single drop within two seconds of it being on the bottom. Oh. Just ate it on the way down. Ate it right on the way down. A little double up. That'll do it. I mean, these are all like really nice fish. They're not afraid to eat a big pogey, are they? Triple? Drew just only catches fish, man. I don't know what to tell you. There you go. One? A big one? I mean, that's a great striper right there. All day long. Sea lice all over them. Oh, yeah. Oh, yes. Oh. Yep. Yeah. Not as good as Steve's and looked better. Oh yeah, we need to get some close ups to that one. Yeah. <laughs> I don't even want to hold my fish up next to that. Are you kidding me? <laughs> that one's a true fish. All right, guys, nice double up here. Steve got an absolute brute. What is yes. that, probably a 30 inch? 30 inch, We got yeah. another 30 sure. right here. And yeah, we got 30s <laughs> on the back. I'm whiffing left and right. <laughs> ah. Oh, but so marked all these fish, seen them on side scan as they're coming underneath the boat, and we're dropping giant like bass flutter spoons, what, eight, nine inch spoons? Yeah. So they weigh an ounce or two, getting them down, jigging them super hard, and they're hitting them on the fall most of the time. As soon as you lift up, you're just filling that dead weight. But yeah, nice fish for you to get these back in the water and uh, get back oh. after it. Yeah, here comes another one. <laughs> <laughs> All right, guys, sorry, go down. Oh, there he is, there he is. <laughs> this is so fun. Oh man. This feels like a decent one. Yeah, that's a good one. This is too fun, guys. Steve, thanks, brother. We're having a blast. All right, so the rod that was getting it done today for us was the TFO Professional 7-foot medium. Uh, we're fishing, and surprisingly, the way that, and, and we were told that this was kind of what we wanted to fish. I was expecting we are going to be fishing a heavier rod setup because we're fishing two-ounce jigs, ounce-and-a-half jigs, um, and, and, and really heavier than what I would throw on a rod like this back home. But you really did want it, and it was plenty of rod for the fish. But this was uh, this this is a local uh, soft plastic that we were throwing, local jig heads. But really, just trying to hop the bottom. You know, it's just generic striper fishing of what we're doing back home. But so we were fishing 40, 50, 60 feet of water a lot of times. But at the end of the day, the old flutter butter, same rod, seven and a half, seven foot medium TFO professional, 
Uh, but these these spoons that look obnoxiously large were getting it done and really really cool by it so you're same kind of deal hopping on the bottom but you're trying to let it fall with a slack line and man that was it was sweet to to get bit on that and, and we were catching we had some you know 18 19 inch fish on this and we had some 30 plus inch fish on this so um, just to you know between the soft plastics and the, the big flutter spoon that was uh, what was getting it done but the rod for both that worked real well was a seven foot medium tfo professional oh uh, well steve we had a great time yes, sir. put a lot of fish in the boat we thank you for having us up well tell guys how they can reach out to you find you on instagram facebook whatever so instagram is griffins underscore guide underscore service um same as my website is griffinsguideservice.com give me a call 443-624-0088 awesome well, thank you for having us up and we gotta also say thank you to drew <laughs> Time. Glad you're over here mating for us, <laughs> getting baits rigged. Not like we didn't have enough already, but you know. Um, no, it, it was awesome and we had an absolute blast. So we really do thank you all for having us up. And I think we got some other stuff, some other ideas in, in the bank here for potentially making a return trip. Absolutely. So stick around. You're going to be seeing him again. Definitely be seeing Drew again as well. So see what happens next time. <laughs>